Hello, thanks for tuning in. This is the Insurance Guru podcast and video. Um, earlier today, I released a podcast dealing with the Michigan Catastrophic Claims Association raising the assessment on your insurance policy to $220 per vehicle. This used to be $192 per vehicle just last year. Uh, prior to that, it was $172 per vehicle just four months prior to that. And prior to that, it was 160 and 140. Uh, you know, it's just been going up and up and up. And the main reason for this increase is because they were, they had a deficit of $3.9 billion. Now, just to explain what the Michigan Catastrophic Claims Association is, is it's a fund that is set up to reimburse insurance carriers like State Farm, Allstate, citizens, auto owners, any of those uh, that you might have progressive. Uh, in Michigan, it's set up to pay any claims that are above 550000 to reimburse the insurance company. So the insurance company is really only on the hook for the medical portion up to 550000 Well, the problem I see with this is that you're paying a premium for unlimited benefits for medical. Well, if you're paying for unlimited medical benefits, why should you also pay into a fund that's going to cover over 550000 it doesn't really make any sense. You're paying for an unlimited benefit for one side of it, and then you're paying another fund to help offset the cost of this unlimited benefit. So it doesn't really make any sense. Uh, there needs to be some sort of legislation to change this. The problem is, if you say that we're going to cap benefits on an auto accident at 550000 or a million or whatever it is, anybody that would need care over and above that amount may not have it. Uh, you could say, okay, well, it can fall on your Blue Cross Blue Shield or United Healthcare. It's not going to happen that way because they're not going to pay all of the costs that are involved, you know, with having an auto accident. They'll pay for your doctor visits and things like that, but not necessarily all the therapies you might need. So it's kind of a catch-22 that there's two different problems working against each other. Uh, but this is getting out of hand now. $220 per vehicle. That means every car you have on your policy $220 a year premium is going to go directly to the state of Michigan to pay for claims that you might not even have. Um, you might have a claim and you might need this and you might say, hey, this worked out for me. That's true. But you should have the option to purchase a lower amount if you want to. On your homeowner's insurance, you have the option to say, I'd like to purchase a million dollar liability limit or I'd like to purchase a half a million dollar liability limit. You don't have that option here. In your auto insurance, you can only buy unlimited coverage, and then you have to pay on top of that for an insurance policy for your insurance policy. So there's, there's definitely some problems here that need to be fixed. But I wanted to bring that to everybody's attention because I also know that I'm going to be getting a lot of calls over the next six months when everybody sees their rates going up $28 per car, uh, more than they were last year, really with no reason. It has nothing to do with them. It has to do with the state of Michigan. So it's coming uh, July 1st. It'll take effect. So any of your renewals after July 1st will show uh, $220 per car. Now, if you have a six-month policy, it's $110. Uh, but overall for the year, it will be $220. Um, but I plan to do this once a week to help you out understand some of the things with insurance. I have, you know, plan to have a different topic. Uh, if you have any ideas please email me, peter at lucidoinsurance.com. I'd be happy to bring it up, answer your question, and uh, I appreciate you listening. Thank you.